Rahim. Today we will discuss the PV examination in labor and modified Bishop score calculation. The first point is about the assessment of dilatation of cervix. It is defined as the gradual opening of the cervix measured in centimeters from 0 to 10 cm. And 0 means closed cervix, 10 cm dilatation means fully dilated cervix. Now, what changes are assessed in cervical dilatation? Normally, the cervix remains closed and hard. During labor, the cervix changes from tightly closed entrance to a fully open exit for the baby. During labor, intense uterine contraction help to move the baby down and put pressure on the cervix and causes it to open slowly. Let us talk about the average rate of dilatation of cervix in primary and multi gravida. In primary gravida, an average cervix will dilate approximately 1 cm per hour. In multi gravida, the cervix will dilate at the rate of 1.5 cm per hour. Now, how to measure cervical dilatation with the fingers? If one fingertip fits into the cervix, the cervix is considered to be 1 cm dilated. If the tip of two fingers fit, the, this means that cervix is dilated up to 2 cm. Depending on the distance the two uh, fingers can stretch, that will indicate the further dilatation. It is usual to refer to full dilatation as 10 cm. And how to measure cervical dilatation? If you get a ruler or a tape measure, you can stretch your middle and index finger to get an idea of the way to estimate dilatation. So measure your finger size before doing PV examination. Now let us talk about cervical dilatations based on the fingertips. 0 cm means a closed cervix, cervix is not dilated. 1 cm means tip of the finger. 2 cm, 1 finger, 3 cm, 2 fingers, 4 cm, 3 fingers, 5 cm, 3 fingers loose, 6 cm, 4 fingers, 8 cm means index and middle fingers stretched almost fully, 10 cm means index and middle finger fully stretched. After dilatation, let us talk about cervical effacement and length. And what is the definition? Cervical effacement refers to shortening, softening and thinning of the cervix. Let us talk about the measurement of cervical effacement. Measurement of effacement is usually in percentages. The percentage ranges from 0 to 100%. 0% 0 means cervix is not effaced. 100% means cervix is fully effaced. Let us talk about cervical effacement according to the length of the cervix. If the cervical length is 2 or more than 2 cm, cervix is not effaced or 0% effaced. If the cervical length is 1, per 1 cm, cervix is 50% effaced. If the cervix is fully thinned out, means cervix is 100% effaced. Let us talk about the cervical effacement in primary and multigravida. In primary gravida, effacement precedes dilatation of the cervix, whereas in multi-para, both occur simultaneously. Let us talk about the cervical consistency. Cervix may be soft, medium in consistency or firm. So hard cervix means hard like tip of nose. Medium mean medium like chin. Soft means soft like lips. So after discussing the dilatation, the efficacy and consistency, the next point is about the position, cervical position that may be in anterior, middle or posterior. Anterior means that the cervix is pointing to the front and while examining the cervix, the cervix face directly to the fingers. Midline position means that the cervix is more downward toward the feet. And posterior cervical position means that the cervix is facing more toward the back and usually very high up. Let us talk about the fetal station. The fetal station is defined as the level of presenting part in the birth canal in relationship to the ischial spine, which are halfway between the pelvic inlet and the pelvic outlet. Means the fetal station describes how far the presenting part or fetal head has descended into the pelvis. Now what is zero plus and minus station? Zero station means the head is at the level of ischial spine. 
if the head is above the level of ischial spine it is referred to as the minor station if the head is below the level of ischial spine the station is referred to as the plus station now what is the role of ischial spine in measuring the bird station the bird station is measured by identification of ischial spine ischial spines are bony projections inside the pelvis which are used as the reference point in the identification of fetal station let us talk about a few examples of fetal stations and their and their significance minus 5 station means the head is high and has not engaged in the birth canal minus 3 station is when the head is above the pelvis minus 2 station when the head is 2 cm above the ischial spine and is referred to as minus 2 station 0 station when the head is at the level of ischial spine plus 3 station when head is 3 cm below the ischial spine that is called plus 3 station it is when the head is within the birth canal plus 5 station once the baby's head fill the vaginal opening just before the birth that is plus 5 station means the head is crowning now what is the obstetric significance of birth station identification minus 5 to 0 the presenting or most palpable part of the baby is above the woman's ischial spine sometimes a doctor can feel the presenting part this station is known as the floating next is zero station the baby's head is known to be engaged or aligned within the ischial spine with the ischial spine zero to plus five Positive numbers are used when a baby has descended beyond the ischial spine during the birth and the baby is at plus 4 to plus 5 station. Now, this is Bishop's score calculation. Dilatation has got score 0 when it is closed, score 1 when it is 1 to 2 cm, score 2 when it is 3 to 4 cm and score 3 when it is 5 cm. Length is more than 4 cm, then it is score 0. When it is 3 to 4 cm, it is score 1. When it is 1 to 2 cm, the score is 2. When it is 0, then the score is 3. An effacement 0 to 30 percent score 0, 40 to 50 percent score 1, 60 to 70 percent score 2 and 80 percent plus score 3. Consistency firm score 0, medium score 1, soft score 2, position posterior score 0, midline score 1, anterior score 2. Head station minus 3 score 0, minus 2 score 1, minus 1 to 0 score 2, plus 1 to plus 2 score 3. Now, examination and Bishop's score calculation. I would like to complete my presentation with this quote. Hard work spotlights the character of people. Some turn up their sleeves, some turn up their noses, and some do not turn up at all. Thank you so much. Wish you all the best. Allah Hafiz.